after what seems like the longest year of cabin renovations, tons of blood, sweat, and tears, we've come to realize that the whole reason we did any of this is because we love sharing this space with our friends and family. It is something we missed greatly when we were living on the road. And although we're very excited to get back to the road and spend weeks on end with no showers and the unknown adventure of van life, these last few days at our cabin are gonna be incredibly special. Let's go pick up the lads. Where are the lads? Gym, folks. Left, 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 right, left, 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 right, left. 98, 99. Now, a lot of you are looking protein deficient. Where do you get your protein from? Plants. Come on, you piles of dog shit. You gotta move this wood before noon. You lot probably thought you're earning your Wheaties. But we got one more challenge. And it has to do with this here water. <laughs> Now tread the water! Come on! We're terrible friends. <laughs> we love you guys. For those who haven't met our good friends Craig and Amy, this is King and It, fellow YouTubers. We're so excited that they're here for the next couple weeks. And we promise to make it a bunch of fun. <laughs> <laughs> we first connected with Craig and Amy back in 2015 when we stumbled on their YouTube channel and became low-key obsessed. They exude so much positivity, have that good, hearty, contagious laughter that you can't help but love, and have traveled from Iran to Iceland and basically everywhere in between. These two were our first stop on our van life Europe trip in 2019. If you're starting to think they seem fun on camera, you're really just scratching the surface on how great they really are. We're excited to return the hosting favor and have them here at the cabin with us for the next two weeks. Things have already gotten a little out of hand. What is happening, guys? Did this week? <laughs> <laughs> <Craig and> Amy. <laughs> <laughs> With our trip to Morocco coming up, these really are the last few days we have here at the cabin, and there's no one we'd rather spend it with than Kenya! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, <laughs> Cheers to Brecky! Cheers! Just a Cheers. boring old porridge. Cheers. Oh. <laughs> Look at it! Like. Amy's been eating her words lately because we've been making meals that she doesn't usually eat. Mm -hmm. No, there's been a banquet every night and it's amazing. <laughs> mm. And we normally sit this close to each other, don't we? Yeah, we look yeah. Yeah. so much. We always yeah. hold hands at breakfast. Yeah, yeah. Oh, right. yeah you're right. What are we doing? Yeah, we hold hands at breakfast. How do we eat? Amy can't eat. <laughs> <laughs> Now that breakfast is done, we're moving on to dinner because <laughs> all we do is eat. So Come on. We're actually prepping pizza dough because our wood fire pizza oven is finally in. So 
Shout out to that planted fork. We're using your recipe. It needs to sit for six hours. I've never made dough. How do you do it, though? No idea, dough. <laughs> you got no laughter behind the camera. Sorry, dude. I, I honestly just didn't think that was funny. No problem, dude. It's like a lot of work. Really? It's like five minutes here, wait, 20 minutes here, need for 20 minutes. Two and a half tablespoons. Is that about a teaspoon, you think? Mm, yep. Whisk to dissolve. We don't even have a whisk. That's all right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Amy, get out here. Control these, control these men. It smells dank. Oh, it does smell a bit funny. Okay, so now you let that activate. Ooh, yes. <laughs> Part of showing Craig and Amy around is giving them the true Canadian experience. And honestly, what is more Canadian than a moose? <laughs> okay, we're well, gonna go moose riding. We're gonna go moose spotting, but also sea doing and learning to water ski and all of these things in the middle of September when it's good luck, Mr. Holmes. <laughs> nice and chilly. <laughs> Where's the wet suits, guys? Come on. <laughs> what suits? That's not very Canadian. What? <laughs> So we're going to fill up at the local spot. This is Fred and Sandy. And this is just how small town it is. When I first rolled in, I said, hey, can I get an account? And they said, yeah, no worries. And I just left and racked up like a pretty large bill. And finally they're like, hey, like, where do you live? Like, what's your name? And I fixed it up. So. Just, I love that about country folk that are just so trusting and lovely, and they just run this local campground. And I can almost guarantee Fred has never seen anyone talking to a camera before. <laughs> Hi, Ellie. Hi, Ellie. Hi, sweetheart. Hi, my girl. Hi. How's the Hi, day Fred. going? How are you doing? Well, all right. This is my buddy all the way from Wales. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Hi, mister. Hi, mister. Hi, mister. I got so jealous. <laughs> Hi, my beautiful girl. How are you? Hey, buddy. Yeah. Hi. Hey, see you, pal. Thanks for the gas. Props. <laughs> you might also notice that I'm Captain Beeless, which is very upsetting, but she's taking a quick nap. I think it's called jet lag or something like that, you know? Anyways, on the road, boys. Motor on. Motor on. Here's Craig Holmes' first beach docking. Could be a disaster, could be brilliant. <laughs> this could be a, a totaling of a jet ski. <laughs> yeah, come on, rip, rip, rip it off, off, off. Off, 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 off. It was at this moment that he knew he f***ed up. What happened to the off part? I thought you meant like off as in go off. Go off, <laughs> off the machine. <laughs> Craig Holmes broke the jet ski. Beck, don't do what he did. Off! 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 You guys get about off. Yeah, but I didn't get up enough. <laughs> when you were saying off, I thought you meant like off as in like <laughs> lift it off the floor. Yeah, and it goes onto the sand. Like so jump I'm it. Revving it like whoop, whoop. <laughs> And he's going off, off, press the button. You revving it more? <laughs> you can tell by your hair. Show them your hair. <laughs> your hair's oh, your hair. All I can say about that is freaking phew. Craig's gonna be dead. Craig's <laughs> cross, I hope it's not. <laughs> no, it's good. I think the truth is, the boys just brought me to the beach to beach me so that they could each have their own CD so they could just play.
<laughs> lost everything. <laughs> Your sunglasses? <laughs> Oi. Captain. Hey. I was about to get the pots and pans out on you. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> the pizza dough is setting. It's looking good. We'll keep you updated on that. And we've made some quick BLT sandies. And we're going to smash that and then get back outside. Pretty exciting day, huh? I do have some projects I'd like to do if you guys are up for... No. <laughs> Before we head out there and enjoy these last few moments of summer, I wanted to say a big thank you to ThreadUp for sponsoring today's video. Now today we might be swimming, but I know the cold weather is upon us. So if you are like me and you're looking for a few items to fill those fall gaps in your wardrobe, I would highly recommend you check out ThreadUp. It is an online thrift store with over 40,000 brands that you know and love, and they are always updating daily. Not to mention you can find your favorite brands for up to 90% off the estimated retail price. Shopping secondhand is also amazing for the environment because it stops the clothing from going to the landfill. So I'm gonna show you a few of the items that I picked for fall, but make sure you stick around for a special exclusive offer for you. And here we have outfit number one. I've replaced my skinny leg jeans because apparently that's a very millennial thing and I needed to get with the time. So we've got these Banana Republic jeans, normally 80 bucks and I got them for 20. And this free people bodysuit which just screams fall, normally 60 bucks and I got it for 20. And this top's from Nasty Girl Inc, normally 60 bucks and I got it for 14.99. And this cozy knit is from Free People, normally $128, and I got it to 50. How much? 50. Lastly, we've got this Coach card holder that normally retails for $85, and we scored it for 15. So seriously, if you need a wardrobe refresh for fall and this cold, impending weather, check out ThreadUp and use code BECK for an extra 30% off your first order. All right, so welcome to the Skill Olympics. Uh, this is going head to head, couple versus couple. I'm gonna take the skis. Amy's gonna try after. If you don't know what the Skill Olympics, it was a super successful uh, <laughs> video series on King and It's channel. The King and It Skill Olympics is a game show where. One. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> it's so much fun. I loved hey, it. Hey, fun over views, right, Craig? Yeah, exactly, mate. That's what, that's what we're here for. Yeah. <laughs> So today we're gonna teach uh, Amy how to water ski and Craig how to wake skate. But first, Beck is gonna show water skiing. Oh, no pressure. You haven't huh? gone in a while, huh? I haven't been in a minute. Season. Here you Thank go. You. Good luck. Rule your own world. <laughs> Amy gets up, second try. I agree, second try. How are you feeling, babes? <laughs> I'm not sure if the guys realise this. Like, Craig's got many names for me. Uh, Trev, Clive, <laughs> Drive. But the main one is Calamity Bannister. So <laughs> Bannister's my second name. Calamity is my nature. So, <laughs> how far did you say the hospital was? <laughs> like, an hour. Just an hour. <laughs> if we can hold on for that. No, I mean, I'm really nervous about yeah, this. I've never so done anything great. like it, and Beck makes it look so easy. Absolute pro. Such a natural. So don't go to, no, stop it now. No, no, don't no, go no. Too fast. Oh, Amy. I'm gonna, no. it's gonna just be a butter ride. I know you. Butter, Amy. butter, <laughs> butter. <laughs> okay, but. I'll get in, yep. Yeah, yeah. jump that in, girlfriend. <gasps> Water skiing, the very first time in Canada. She looks terrified. <laughs> First try. She's got another try. I think she can do it.
<laughs> Ambulance. <laughs> oh shit. That was so good, eh? Oh, sick. I fell flat on my back. Oh no. I couldn't breathe for a minute. <laughs> My bathing suit is right up there. <laughs> How do you feel, babes? I feel, um, I don't know. Emotional? Emotional. <laughs> uh, cold? Just, uh, yeah, adrenaline punctured. <laughs> adrenaline punctured. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness me. Now it's time for some wake skating. My name's Gerald, and this here's an acid drop. Hit it! I just had to show off in front of my buddy Holmes and he's ready to go so let's see what he's got first time first time getting pulled by anything in the water yeah <laughs> here you go wake skating attempt number one at 33 years of age attempt number three this is the one So something we're really excited about is this weekend, our beautiful friend Lee, her sister Sasha, who we've become really, really good friends with over the past year uh, and a bit, um, her she's getting married, so it's her wedding, and Craig and Amy are joining us, and Craig mentioned that he, uh, he's got some skills on the knife, so we're going to clean up the fade a little bit. I love how he, he hasn't seen any of my work. And he's just like, yeah, just give me a haircut. Well, your hair's always looking pretty good. I guess you don't do your own hair though. I do, yeah. Do you? Yeah. You stand in the mirror and just bang it? Yeah. Nice. Craig isn't actually a barber. He does his own hair and his family's. So. Oh, so that's a barber in our book. Yeah. Eamon's let just about anybody try this, haven't you? Yeah, honestly, if you're confident enough, you can have a go. So what I've done is I've added a bit of volume and we've gone for a little bit of a color change because I feel like it would just suit Eamon's personality more. Before you have a shower mate, just show us what it looks like. Oh, okay, one sec. Oh, wow. Why won't you wait for me, wait okay. for me. What do you think guys? That's, that's some of my finest work. Oh my gosh, thank you. I, I, I'm worried we took a little bit off the back, but I think it'll be fine. All right, I was just about to tell the vlog that honestly we just can't stop Hearing it fun? from Amy. Oh. Well, yeah, having fun. <laughs> but I was gonna like, you know, take a minute and breathe, and Amy's just like, oh, we should go for a run. Oh, yeah, she just wants to do so much. Do a much. workout, like really lift, lifting day. weights and stuff. <laughs> and we're all just trying to chill, man. What do you about your nan the cabin? So um, I'm gonna go for a quick nap. <laughs> um, you feel free to do whatever you like, and I'll see you in about 22 minutes. Okay. Thank you. Sure, turn the wash, but we're gonna go for a run anyway. That was great, guys. Loved it. <laughs> <laughs> See you, mate. Come to the cabin for some uh, R&R, that's what they said. You're not getting that? 
Hey, uh, Gina, what are we doing? Okay, I shredded some uh, cheese, cut up some mushrooms, got some onion, sun-dried tomatoes, a little bit of olives, missing some key ingredients, but I never hurt nobody. The doughs are looking really good, though. I know, I'm really proud. Really nice, baby. Okay. So we'll spread those out, sauce them, and bake them. I need a score out of 10. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. That's banging. That is a 8.5 for me. Mm -hmm. <whistles> undercooked. A little bit undercooked. He's being a little nice. Really good flavor. <laughs> you put a little, you went a little chili happy as well. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 2.5. Yeah. <laughs> 1.5 no 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 no. it has a lot of potential and this is only one pie of like 10 so yeah. mm. let's give it a six by the end of the night we're gonna have 10 out of 10. I think that's a fair, if we do an average score. it'll be like a 7.5 or mm -hmm. seven let's say seven uh -huh. final score pizza one mm. i was trying to be nice pizza's a bit dodgy all right captain b honest opinion whilst the guys aren't here honestly it looks lovely Cheers to pizza number 10. I think this is it. If it's not a 10 out of 10, then we quit being pizzeria. Look at that, no flop. Cheers. 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 It's not a lot. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. 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 Oh, mm. That fresh basil. Mm. Mm. That's a 10 out of 10. It's beautiful. It's really nice. good pizza. Yeah, it is really good. Good company, good pizza. Good, good time. <laughs> Yeah. I felt bad straight away. <laughs> That's bad karma. Bad karma in the morning. But I do feel like revenge for Raymond would be very sweet and I'm a bit worried. Yeah. <laughs> When's it gonna come? As we gear up to head to the wedding this weekend, we realize it's kind of tricky to um, glamour. What's the word I'm looking for? Glamorify? Glamorize. Glamorize? A couple of van lifers? No. <laughs> I gotta get her wedding ready. <laughs> so I'm heading to my closet to figure out uh, just what we've got to wear. Slim pickings. <laughs> Although this is what I was thinking for Craig, which I think would real you could really pull off. Oh, nice! That is nice. Isn't that nice? Yes, Craig. It's smart. That's your one option, Craig. <laughs> one and only. And I borrowed these two dresses from my sister, so we'll see if we can make these work. <laughs> okay, try it. Okay. Party. I'll try the blue one on. <laughs> <laughs> I was kind of hoping Beck would have like wrap around stuff, you know, a bit of room at a healthy Christmas. So I'm not sure if anything she's got is going to fit me. <laughs> Stop it. So, you know, it's been a while. Ooh. Captain B. <laughs> I knew she'd look better in my dress than me. Oh, stop it. No, look at her. Oh, I love it on you. It'd be great with the red hair, I think. Oh, yes. Yeah, I, think, I was thinking blonde would be good with that. Blonde I would thought Aiden was going to borrow the blonde. I'm versatile. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, great. Yeah, okay, this is a great option. I still want to go shopping, though. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>
just got half an hour out, and I think I might have left the stove on, the gas stove. Hey, I was wondering if you can send me Ann's number. I'm like uh, an hour away from my house, and I think I might have left the stove on. Shout out to our neighbor Ann for going over and turning off the stove. You're a legend. That's why you have neighbors, folks. That's why you have good neighbors. More. I was wondering if you can send me Ann's number. I'm like uh, an hour away from my house and I think I might have left the stove on. Shout out to our neighbor Ann for going over and turning off the stove. You're a legend. That's why you have neighbors, folks. That's why you have good neighbors. More. The other day, Eamon and I popped in here and he bought a suit that is so outrageously expensive, it broke the bank. It was $29. So he's picking that up today. How much was that? 29 How it? much? How much? Wasn't it 29 29 Put your mask on, put your mask on, we're inside. Oh, and Amy's found a suit for her. <laughs> Ew! Lester Holmes! Look at the trolley smells so big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy! Oh, very like Wow! That. Whoa! <laughs> you look swaggy. Nice. Can we get a price point on total? Whatever they are, we're buying one. $19.99 and $14.99. Winner? Winner, Ganyon. Amy, you got four minutes. She went in to get shoes. Came out with another dress. <laughs> Are we good to go now, Amy? Uh, yeah, I've got everything I need. I'm happy. <laughs> I won't tell you how much it costs until we get away from the shop. <laughs> well, the truth is, she spilled coffee on her last dress <laughs> and all over the sofa in the back. Calamity so. banister. On the last dress, meaning as soon as we took off from the store, coffee <laughs> just ended up on the dress. Okay, we're going now. We got a four hour drive. As you can imagine, there's been a lot of YouTube conversation. We really do love hanging out with other creators because it gives us an opportunity to talk about our business with people who understand. And uh, Amy back there was going off about how her mom and sister love the vlog. So shout out to Helen and Hannah, all Hi, the way Hi, in Hannah. Wales. <laughs> Appreciate the support, ladies. You happy now, Amy? Yeah. <laughs> Give me the money. <laughs> After a very long day, a couple thrift stores, and many hours behind the wheel, we've arrived. We just had dinner, it was absolutely wonderful. And this... It's Tiger Lily! We love it! <laughs> Night one at the wedding. It's going really good. Big bonfire. I'm trying to get to bed early. Getting ready for a big day too. Good night. Amy B, what have you got planned? You ready for a wedding? <laughs> no, I put like an outfit together yesterday in my head. I'm yeah. wondering if it's gonna, if I'm gonna execute or not. A little bit worried. At what point will you realize if you've executed? When I come out and you laugh. <laughs> <laughs> so, so be kind, yeah? How you going? I'm going good. You guys ready to get changed? Yes. Let's clean up, lads. Oh, you look so good. <laughs> Hold on. How you feeling? <laughs> that was easily the most fun we've had in a really long time. Best wedding I've ever been to. It was the wedding we were waiting for to really wrap up our time here in Canada and I feel like it just finished everything with a bang. I'm so happy for Sasha and James and now we can start thinking about gearing up to travel again. 
We hope you guys enjoyed this one. We have no idea what we're doing next week, <laughs> and we'll see you Sunday. See you Sunday. Now go call someone you love and tell them, man, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> but we know that the cabin is alive. <laughs> oh, Craig. Stand up straight, you two. <laughs> I saw the video you two made. <laughs> <laughs> they call me Fitzgerald, and this is an acid drop. Hit it! Oh, shit! <laughs> Hit it! <laughs> so close! <laughs> I gotta get it!